I've been trying to make this video for about a month now. Well, not really this video. Actually, this footage was supposed to be for a video about my new city of Cologne. But every time I tried to film it, it just didn't really work out very well. So after a few times of trying, I decided to scrap it, call it quits, and make a video about failure instead. It's easy to get disheartened when it comes to photography or video or any type of creativity really. Uh, it's a long, never-ending learning process and failure, it comes up a lot, or at least it does for me anyway. And when it does, I usually go pretty hard on myself. To me, it always feels like a bigger, world-ending problem than what it actually is. My silly little brain always goes to worst case scenario, I'm not good enough to do this or I don't have the skills to do this or I don't have the talent to do this which of course is <laughs> being a little bit dramatic and something that I've noticed since I started this YouTube channel especially is that this is happening more often that feeling of failure that feeling of going out to shoot a video and it's a complete disaster and then you have to call it quits and wait until the next weekend and that is always a problem for me because I don't have a whole lot of time to film these videos so I usually do it on the weekends so if the weekend is a disaster, then I have to wait until next week. And that's very frustrating. And it leads to a lot of self-blame and me blaming myself for not being good enough to get it done when I want to. You see, I have lots of ideas, lots of other YouTubers that I look up to, lots of people that I, I watch. And I think I want to be able to make videos like them. And I want to be able to make videos like them right now. And I've been trying to do that and failing most of the time. But the problem is I've been concentrating too much on the second part, the failing, and not enough on the trying. You see, when you're failing, that means you're trying. And ultimately, I think that's a good thing. You know, this channel is something that I think a lot of you can probably relate to. Is It's, it's something new for me. And when you do something new, it means you have to it means you have to try and it means you have to, to fail a lot. Anything creative or otherwise, it's all always a learning process. Some of the bigger problems I have with that though is patience. Uh, when I start something new like this, I often fall into the trap that I want to be able to do it now. I want it all like right now. But of course, that's never how it works. And in fact, that's not even the most enjoyable part. Usually it's the learning and the figuring out is enjoyable, but you only realize that after you finish doing it. Failing, I think, means that you have to wait and you have to have patience. I often catch myself looking at other photographers or other creators and think, I want what they have and I, I want it now. But, but of course, it doesn't work like that. I, I can't have what they have because I haven't done what they've done. I haven't done the work that they've done and I haven't had the experiences that they've done. And most importantly, I'm not them. This lack of patience, this uh, whatever interaction with failure often skews my process. It causes me to lose focus on what I should be doing and the work that I should be doing and the work that I want to do. I stop creating for me and I start creating to be somebody else instead. 
And that doesn't work because that's not me. I think the secret is to not push it so hard. Take inspiration, but keep doing you. Sometimes you just gotta go out there and do it for fun. Add in elements of inspiration here and there when you can, but keep the spark that makes you, you. I think it's important for me to do my thing and fail. Instead of getting bogged down in it, I want to try and learn to enjoy it. That's what these videos are all about really, a place for me to do what I enjoy. And that means trying and failing and learning and all of the above. It sometimes means calling it quits after trying to film the same video for four weeks and just realizing that maybe it's not the best idea and to start from scratch with something else. Sometimes it doesn't mean giving up entirely. It just means giving it a break and coming back again tomorrow. Sometimes you just need the headspace to take a step back and refocus on what it is that you want to do and not what other people want to do. And what I'm learning and what I've learned over the last few weeks is that all of that stuff is important because that's how you learn. And as for my own little mini adventures with what I'm doing with my own photography, my own creativity, I think that it's important to try and fail, but most of all to try and it's important for me to do what I'm doing here in this channel. I don't even know why I think it's important for me to do this but there's just something in me that says that it is and that I should keep doing and trying and failing and learning. And none of these thoughts are really my answers on any of this topic. It's complicated but I think there's some of you out there that maybe might be able to relate to this feeling of, of dealing with failure and if it resonates with one of you then that's enough for me. So there you have it, my thoughts on failing. Try, fail, make mistakes, keep trying, keep going, keep learning, keep doing. Thanks for watching, I'll see you soon.